Yeah. Let's see what happens. Oh boy, there we go. Last I left off, I was here. Yep. So I need to find the apartment for an HR, I believe. Helena. There's a Helena, and then there's a. Um, uh, I forgot the other lady's name. But there's two women, both with the initials H something. I need to go find them. Let's look at the objectives right now. Uh, HN, there we go. Hannah Nader and... Oh, I guess I'm going to do that one first. Well, oh, they're really close to each other, so apartment 104, apartment 106. So let's figure out where those two are right now. I can check out his room. Neat. Matter of fact, I think for the comfort of my own wrist... And it's not really super necessary for precision. I'm going to use a controller right now. Oh, uh, yes, I will for a while like a crazy person. That's what I like. Okay. Sorry, my wrist has been a little, uh, sensitive. Nanophage and I. This is just as good. For the purposes of, uh, you know, slow pace. Exploration horror game. That. Kukowski, Janice. Oh, it's, it's a guy. Okay. Janice Kukowski. Jerkowski. Neo Pagan. My electrical scan here. Oh, I zoom in. There we go. Some update recommended. And that dude doesn't seem like he's all too concerned with the latest firmware updates. So, device wise, that was the only thing of interest to look at. Um, so, let's go log on if we can. The wall stands tall. Yeah, this is the propaganda um, story we read the other day. Dear Mr. Joukowsky, while we all greatly while we all greatly appreciate your ex oh my god I can't read today what happens when I don't drink coffee while we all greatly appreciate your exemplary service and the sacrifices you have made for your country the VRI policy enforces a strictly proactive stance on helping our brave veterans reintegrate with society regular coverage requires a deed of permanent B class employment presented to our representative on an annual basis your current janitorial position simply does not quantify. Given these circumstances, we must sadly deny your claim and therefore force to terminate your participation in the program effective immediately. As of today, the Veteran Pension Fund will no longer cover periodic maintenance of your cybernetic prosthetics. We wish you all the best, the Veteran Rehabilitation Initiative. Oh yeah, how nice. I mean, they totally love the veterans, unless, you know, unless they live in a lower class and afford anything else, so like, fuck them. Let's let their bodies degrade. Cool. All the best science fiction is rooted very closely to real life. Unfortunately. Enough is enough. Alright, this has gone on long enough. Veteran or not, I do not give a crap anymore. One more message and I'll find you and beat the fucking junk out of you. And my mother can no longer take this shit. She's sick of telling you over and over that her husband, my father, died 18 years ago. He's moved on. Okay, yeah, I don't really know. Mike Jerkowski is dead. Oh, look at that. Ground floor. Kowski. Mazorski. Murski. Sadowski. A lot of skis here. Olkowski. Hoffman. Badowski. Novak. Lena. Hater. Storage space. With fire and sword spiders, the hit game of the year. Any organic material I need to investigate? No. Okay. Good. 
let's move forward. Oh wait, the audio actually might be a little imbalanced. Let me fix that for you guys. I don't want to drown my mic out. Probably will, because the game has some fairly loud sounds, but uh, yeah. Let's make sure it sounds a little good. Also, if you are in the Twitch viewer, or I guess on Facebook when I do the recap, feel free to talk in the comments. I'll be there to reply to you, whether verbally or in the chat. So there's a, I, I'm not a huge fan of the visual, of the graphical setting called um, Chromatic Aberration. I probably mentioned that a shit ton of times on this channel. But when it's done correctly, like this game, I can appreciate it. Like there's just like a soft digital effect, like a, I guess a digital softness that's added to the image. And it works really well in the context of this game, I think. In other situations, like when it's just a standard, you know, non-futuristic, non-sci-fi, thematically inappropriate situation, it just really muddies things up and makes it feel odd and distracting. Like here it makes an entire sense because, you know, just look at the world. Digitized, it's connected. My character is probably not using his own eyes. I love these birds, they seem very strange. Ooh, that thunder is loud. Okay, we're looking for a 104, huh? We gotta go to the first floor. One hundred one to one hundred four. Hey, you! I can hear you out hey, there. It's the demo Help area. Me, please. Where are you? Hello? KPD. I'd like to have a word. It's about time. That's not him. Up. What the hell is going on? Why are we under lockdown? Most likely a malfunction. I'm still looking into it. You ain't looking in the right places. Cause I don't know nothing. Notice that's a double negative. Suspicious or unusual. Other than the lockdown, I mean. Well, Other than the lockdown. A couple from 104 were making an awful lot of noise a while back. More than usual, I mean. The girl ran off. And then it got quiet. Hmm. Did you see where she ran off to? I ain't one to snoop. But. Judging by the footsteps, I'd say she ran down to the courtyard. Really? Anything else you can tell me about them? What? The couple? Don't know them that well. The girl seems nice enough. Not sure about the guy, though. What about the girl? Oh, she she's a trooper. Works double shifts at Chiron to support that ex-con asshole of a husband. Any idea what she might be doing for them? Can't be too important, or she wouldn't be living in this shithole. Mm -hmm. Explains the look on her face, though. What do you mean by that? Worn out, fidgety, jumping in shadows. Working for the corporation so as an effect. Huh? I guess. Does this kind of stuff happen often? You ever see the husband get violent? Nah, nah, he ain't a wife beater or anything like that. He's just messed up. And again, ain't we all? What can you tell me about the guy? Amir? I think he's called. He looks tough, but he's got the yellow eye, you know? Twitches like a junkie. Probably sells the shit, too. How do you know that? What, the dealing? I see him sneak around during the night, carrying packages and stuff. I dealt he's the goddamn postman. Anything else out of the ordinary? Very Anything nosy neighbors. Else? Well, other than some asshole bringing animals into the building, I'd say that's pretty much oh, it. Oh, retro. Animals? Hmm. Yeah, I could, uh, I could swear I heard something growling in the hallway earlier. I informed the janitor, but, yeah. He'd lose the plot midway through the talk anyway. Thanks. You've been very helpful. <laughs> That's new. <laughs> Voice acting so far is great across the board. Uh, I've had no problems, no complaints. 
God, I just love the way this game looks. Irato. Impeccable sound, recording quality, even under the harshest conditions. Using tapes. Very interesting. Hey, PD. I'd like to ask you some questions. Certainly, officer. Always glad to do my civic duty. Oh, how nice. You sure are calm. You seem pretty laid back. You do now the building is under lockdown. Well, yes, but there's not much I can do about it, is there? I mean, I'm sure the authorities are handling the situation as we speak. Come to think of it, isn't that why you're here? Yes. Um, sure. Well, there you go. Nothing to worry about, then. Now, is there anything else I can help you with? Uh... Seen or heard anything suspicious lately? Neighbors acting weird? Actually, I did hear some noise. Seems like 104 is the prime culprit here. Then the woman stormed out of the apartment and ran off. What kind of noises, sir? Screaming, breaking stuff. I, I didn't think much of it. I mean, those two are always at each other's throats. Hmm. You mean these people got violent with each other? Well, I'm not sure about violence. Mostly just arguing, I guess. Today was worse than usual. That's probably why she ran out. Did you see where she went? Well, no, I didn't actually see her. I could smell her, you see. Smell? Don't tell me you can't. That cheap crap she pours over herself, the entire hallway reeks of it. She probably thinks it makes her seem ladylike. I see. I got it. Thanks for your help. I could hear her panting, too. Moaning like the whore she is. Oh, wow. Did, huh? Yeah, biggest fucking cock tease you've ever oh, seen. Oh, your Always personality twinkly, changed. Bending over when reaching for the lock. All naked underneath her clothes. She knows I'm watching, too. She likes to make me itch. Cooped up with that junky meathead. I mean, what does he have that I don't? They're all like that, you know? Fucking mongoloid bitch. Oh, boy. I hope boy. she what she fucking deserves. So that she knows she's fucked up. She'll have no choice but to come to me. Begging. But it'll be too late. You hear me? Too late. Whoa. All right. Dudes on the internet. Okay. How about you shut the fuck up? Well, that was certainly oh, I missed it. for. Good day to you, officer. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm sure he walks out of his apartment and goes milady a couple of times a week. Fuck his comeback. I deserve the woman's attention. Wee. Oh Jesus. So unfortunate there are actual people like that in the world. Way more than I need to be. Hey, woman, please be there. I am the alpha male. Blah, blah, blah. Also, I don't want to miss the other apartment. So, I'm going to go to 107 first. Probably some goodies I'd miss if I go straight to where I need to be. Miss Nader, I'm with the KPD. Mind if I ask you a few questions? That was 106 or that was 107? Mrs. Excuse me? Mrs. Nader. All right. Uh, Mrs. Nader. What do you want? Are you all right? Ma'am, is everything all right in there? Are you in some kind of danger? You tell me, officer. I heard the alarms go off. Are the cleaners on their way? Are any of us safe? The lockdown seems to be a malfunction. I don't think we're looking at an outbreak here. Well, I'm sure the other tenants will be glad to hear that. But not you? No, officer. Not me. Have you made any calls in the last hour? No, I have not. Could you check your compass for connections? Somebody may have used it as a proxy. I don't have a compass. No compass. I thought pretty much everyone had one at this point. Well, you thought wrong. Mm. I don't have any implants of any kind. Really? If you don't mind my asking, do you live alone? Yes, I do mind. And yes, I live alone. No spouse or daughter. Didn't you hear me? I said it was just me. Then why did you insist on being called Mrs.? 
I'm a widow. My wife died many years ago in the plague. Well, that'll make someone upset. I'm sorry Girlie. to hear that. Is that why you don't have any implants? Yes. Want to see the scar tissue on my face and neck? It's quite an embroidery. I can the partially see it. Really outdid themselves. Or do I have to show you what's left of my arm? Would that satisfy your curiosity? Mrs. Nader, I'm just doing my job. Huh, yes, I've heard that one before. When the cleaners took my Laura away, one of them turned to me and said precisely that. I never saw her again. No. Oh. Not even the body. It's like she never existed. No, that's mean. I'm not like that. No? Oh, so you don't work for the corporation? The very same people who took everything I ever had? Just because they pay me doesn't mean they owe me. Well, isn't that a pretty thought? You best get on with your duties, officer. I'm sure you have your hands full. So long, Mrs. Nader. Helena, no back pages. Indeed it is, but let's keep looking around because, oh my, this is pretty. My goodness. Bump up the volume just a little bit here. Yes, I can hear everything. This is why I have tinnitus. I think this is the hallway that they let me play two E3s ago. I walked down this passageway around here. It was a very, very brief demo just to see what the game looked like, but uh, pretty sure this was it. Look at this. Someone needs to put these wires away. This cable management is just atrocious. I'm not even sure what I'm supposed to be doing around here, but oh, look at TV. Uh, why is that toilet gurgling? I'm pretty sure toilets shouldn't be gurgling. Gross. Can I please flush it. Oh, hello. <laughs> ah, yes, the suit. I'm afraid it's necessary. Do you know why? Because he's scared of me. What? Hello, young man. Interesting. I'm Dr. Landis. Do you know why you're here? You look like a big marshmallow. Ah, yes, the suit. I'm afraid it's necessary. Do you know why? Whoa, where am I? He's scared The door slammed shut? What? I'm locked in. Oh. Oh gosh, what's happening? Um. Oh god. Oh, it's you. What happened? Did you lock me in? Very strange. Something is amiss in this place. A scan of that, I got not forget. We war components that work pretty well in water. Uh, let's go back to Helena then. Hey, bro. What the hell's going on? No longer supported. Oh, look at that. Little maze here of apartments. Hey, you! 
I can hear you out there. Help Mr. me, please. Oh, you. Hello, I missed you before. What's wrong, sir? Oh, I heard this awful noise. What's going on? There's been a lockdown. A lockdown? No. Oh, God, please, not today. Why? Are you okay? Sounds like you're in pain. Oh, it's fine. I'm just... I got a, a condition. I'm, I'm waiting to have it fixed. Anything I can do? <laughs> sure. If you're an expert in corrective surgery. Well, what's so special about today? I was scheduled to undergo a, a medical procedure. It's a private matter. I'd, I'd, I'd rather not talk about it. Hmm. So do yourself. Sir, I'm wondering if you've seen anything suspicious lately. I haven't seen anything oh. in over 40 years. Ah, that's your condition. I, I, I really don't feel comfortable talking about it. Fine, I won't waste your time then. Hey, wait, I did hear something. Quiet footsteps, deliberate, heavy oh God. breathing, angry. Not There's a hiding. nanophage person somewhere here, isn't there? Hmm. Anything else? The smell. It seemed uh, oddly familiar. Huh. Reminded me of my childhood. Your childhood? Yes. My family lived outside the city with all manner of creatures. When it would rain, the smell would be similar. Hmm. Alright, sounds like we've got a nanophage infected. Wandering these halls. Not good. So this game's gonna have scares of two time of two kinds. Oh bot blood. When we go into the minds of others. Still fresh. And the nanophage, dudes. Let's see. Anyone here? They changed that window. Oh, there's more blood on him this time. Oh my god, his guts are out. That was not like that in the preview. He is far worse now. His face also has glass, like gashes on it. Yeah, they messed him up even worse. Don't be afraid. I'm here to help. What happened here? My god. Listen to me. The building is on lockdown. There's no way I can help you now. But I can get whoever's responsible for this if you help me find him. Don't try to talk. There's another way. Alright. Subject approved. Commencing neural interrogation. Yeah, they made this part a little scarier, huh? Alright, we're in for some shit now.
Oh boy. Things are not what they seem. Usłyszenia rośliny następuje częściowa arcenizacja hios czy jaminy. Zyszony surowiec zawiera zmienne ilości antropiny. Halucynogenne i trujące działanie surowca, obecnością alkaloidów troponowych, mechanizm i działania powiedzą. Yep, this is certainly layers of fear -esque. Yeah, uh... Thanks. Wait, this stuff over here and look at this. Anophage quarantine. So there was an outbreak in the building at some point. Size one, but on ski. Lots of imagery of prison. I mean, this guy has nightmares still of being there. He did look like he could be a kind of unruly guy. Lots of angry gang tattoos. What the fuck, man? I told you not to show up during the day. Uh. Unholy Wolfman. Stop it. Bad sync. You'll run in here. Bunch of garbage. Back in this hallway. Dude did not have a good time in prison. What the fuck is that? That thing is huge. That thing is much bigger, much more detailed. And scarier than what I saw in the demo. What the heck is that noise it's making? Oh boy. My frame rate's actually shrugging a little bit. This game is, uh, very effect heavy. Door with the shelf to the left and the chair to the right. The door 
next to the light. Door next to the panel. Oh god, it's pulling me. Ah! I got pulled into the TV. This is where the demo ends, so I have no idea what's after this point. It's fucking slop again. There's no slop there, it's just. It's called soup. I dig in, it's not getting any better. Hey, that's the dude I'm supposed to be in inside of right now. He's not having a good time. How am I separate from this situation? Like I said earlier, there's, the sound design is really good. I can smell you. What? You can smell me. It's gonna be alright. Can't. 
It's, it's gonna be all right. I, need to get out. I, I won't. I won't. I need to get out. Out of here. I won't. I need to get out. I won't. Back as Lazarski. Now I'm back as him. I need a fix. Give it to me now. Fuck yes. Finally! What is happening? I can't tell if something's chasing me here or not. Uh. Oh shit. Oh my god, the imagery. I don't know what's happening. Amir, do you remember the night we met? It's hard to forget. Wow. This looks awesome. Sorry, I had to take screenshots. Looks great. Underneath all your muscles and tattoos, you were like a big wounded animal, lost, alone. Hey, at least you know what you were getting into. Yeah, I, I guess, guess I, I did. did. Voices are changing. What? If I could play this game in VR, oh my god. In sickness and in health, forsaking all others. Are you getting married to a tattoo parlor? And a whole, nice. From this day forward, until death do us part. Or not. No. No, it's merging with Daniel's memories. Seems like a dangerous thing to do if your memories can get merged like that. Not for the uh, weak-willed. Am I not allowed in the shower? Okay, forget the shower. Okay, that happens too.
way too quiet. Looks like we know what did it. How advisable was it? Interrogation aborted. Subject expired during questioning. Emergency extraction procedure successful. Jeez. That's not how you unplug safely. Holy shit, that was a bit much. Synchronization is low. I have a third vision type? I don't know what type this is. I am low on health. Malware detected. Work with Chiron. Productive citizen. Avoid civil demotion. Remain active. Apply for an authorized appointment now. Perform daily inspections of C-Class districts sewage systems. Constantly stand, stand by regarding any potential malfunctions of waste processing plants. Don't know if malfunction. Look at that. So we basically have janitorial positions here. Hmm. It's showing again. I managed to salvage most of it, but like I said before, you have to give the de decryption tool more time to break through the scramblers. If we are to keep this arrangement, you need to deliver on your end. This is sensitive data. Each distorted line of code means hours of additional work, and my time is very precious. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. The software is undetectable. The only way you're getting caught is if someone catches you with physically... catches you physically interacting with the workstation. I know you're scared, and I am well aware of the risk this situation puts you in, but that's precisely what I'm paying you for. Sorry, Hella. I know we got... Go way back. We go back a ways, but I really can't help you with this. I really wish I could, but even putting aside Amir's ongoing health issues, 
The higher-ups have enforced a strict hiring policy. No C-class citizens, and especially no ex-cons. So if they don't want you to be in C-class, and they tell you to get a job, but they prevent you from getting a job because you're in C-class, it's a horrible cycle, huh? Real world, huh? Uh, the, I know Amir's not a bad guy, he deserves another shot, but there's really no way I can get around these asinine regulations. Again, I'm really sorry. If there's any other way I can help, let me know. Aneta. Uh, And make problems go away for good. That's a nice thing to put on your resume when you have face tattoos. Oh, shit. With fire and sword spiders? What level is this? Oh, we got level 4 with fire and sword spiders. Can you believe it? Easy! Oh, I don't have a heart, so I can't. Dead. Oh no, the spiders! <laughs> Let's not do this right now. Pretty funny, though. Let's clear this room, and then we shall call it a day. Like I said, I don't want to reveal too much for initial preview. And they also want to enjoy the game for full review at my own discretion instead of streaming it. Plus, do you really want to watch two hours of the game before you play it? I don't know. I don't think you do. That's a lot of blood. Let's see what hurt this guy. Extensive internal intestinal damage, life-threatening severity. Pattern indicates gang affiliation. Traces of controlled substance 4-5-F detected. That. Chemical trace detected. Controlled substance 45-F. Yikes. Well, we saw from his dreams that he's addicted to whatever that drug is. Chiron Corporation ID. Low level clearance, but still valid. Elena, no. Fuck. That. Air. Whose hair? Some strange looking hair. Abnormal Nothing. genetic structure. Not animal. Oh boy. What the hell is nanophage doing? What am I missing here? And is oh wait, what's that? Synchrozine. Synchrozine collected. What's this? More feed. Some under the counter painkillers. The numbers on them might lead me to Amir's clients. Huh. One twelve and two oh nine. We're done here then. Leaving the crime scene. Pursuing a lead. The victim's wife could still be in the building. Maybe the neighbors know something. Alright, that's been about another hour of Observer uh, of the preview. I don't think I'm gonna do a third part just because um I, it's like I said I wanna enjoy the game 
at my own discretion for review, and uh, I probably shouldn't show three hours of the game just yet, back to back, before it launches. Um, just that's my own personal thing, not that it's a restriction. The VR Sanctuary is where I'm supposed to end, and I think that might be a cup next. So again, uh, anyway, just thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to look for our uh, review of the game, stay tuned on RelyOnHorror.com within the span of a week. You should have something up. If you want to read my preview observer based on the uh, demo I played a couple of months ago, that's also on Rely on Horror right now. Um, of course, follow all of our channels if you can. And if you feel so inclined, donate to the Twitch page any amount that you feel comfortable with, just as a little tip for, uh, for our content. And if you want to support us long term, just you can put a dollar a month, a dollar or more a month on our Patreon at rely, uh, patreon.com slash rely on horror. That will allow us to further afford um, gear and games for coverage and uh, you know also eventually institute a better staff salary so if you really want to support us check that out and you get some cool goodies each month for that. Oh, thank you so much. See you soon.